Katrina is taking a walk when she trips and cuts her hand. If you have a small cut, first apply pressure to the wound to reduce the bleeding. Applying pressure helps constrict the blood vessels, preventing blood from flowing through. Then, clean the wound with mild soap and water, removing any debris. Do not use rubbing alcohol or hydrogen peroxide to clean the cut, which can slow the healing process. Place a bandage against the length of the cut to help close the wound and protect against infection. Remember to change it frequently to keep it clean. To recap, apply pressure to reduce bleeding. Clean with mild soap and water and use a bandage. Always see a doctor if the injury was caused by a bite or if you think it has become infected. Signs of infection include swelling, pus forming, or increasing pain. More serious cuts should not be treated at home. Call 999 or your local emergency number if you are unable to stop the bleeding, the cut is very large, you have trouble moving body parts, have severe pain, or still have debris stuck inside the cut. But if your cut is not as serious, it should heal within about two weeks.